Hey there everybody, Jerry here from Android Central and we're gonna have a look at the new Beautiful Widgets Beta that's come out for uh, tablets. Got a neat little plus on there that we didn't have before. So you go to your Zoom and you open it up and make sure widgets are selected. And you go through and you see you've got quite a few here that are beautiful widgets. Uh, let's pick with the new one here. It's beautiful super clock designed for a tablet. Let's start with that one. And you can see, you know, it, it comes up. If you've used beautiful widgets, you're familiar with how it works. If you have it, you tap that button. It goes into your weather and shows you your weather forecast here. And it has weather animation and gives you some stati uh, statistics over here. You've got a refresh button and menu up here at the top. You can change your clock skin. Uh, I've, I've downloaded one. Go over here and you've got a bunch to pick from to download. Let's just randomly pick one that we think will look nice with Lloyd there on the front page. That one will, I think. Do you want to download this skin? Well, yes. Give it a second and it's downloaded. So let's go back here and select it. And then over here, hit appearance and you can choose other things weather skins. I've got a couple there downloaded. Let's look at some of the rest. You've got a whole bunch of them there. Go through and you find one that catches your eye. It kind of looks nice. We'll download it. And it's downloaded. Go over and which one was it? Uh, that one I think. And you go to your general settings. Uh, it starts out, you have, you know, a bunch of different choices here. This is how your widget's going to be laid out. We've got it set with weather on it, and you've got some different choices. You can also set it to use your battery meter. You can have that in there instead of the weather. I kind of like the way the weather looks on there, so we're going to leave it at that. And I like that layout. Uh, you've got other you know clock settings you can choose 24 hours uh short or long date i like short date and you've got some shortcuts you know tap the minutes on the clock will launch this screen if you want i like it the way it is if i tap the time it will load whatever application i pick same with the date and the forecast you go to weather you can choose your weather service uh you put in your location how often you want to update, I always pick three hours. Celsius, you can have temperature notifications show up in the, I don't know if that works on this yet. Nope, see that's not working here. It's There's a slot for it there, but it just doesn't show up. So we'll uncheck that. This is why this is a beta. Uh, invert low and high temperatures. English weather, I like that one because I like to just read what it is. But anyway, enough of that, you go back and there's your new layout. You've got a, a clock. And let me turn this thing. You see it works both horizontal and vertical. Looks good either way. Put it back so it uses the full screen here on the camera and look at a couple more. You've also got some other widgets you can add. Just, you know, just like we're used to. There's beautiful battery widget. Uh, I've got it set at that widget. I can go back here where I was before, hit menu, settings, appearance, and I can select battery skin. So you've got a, a bunch there. It's really getting a lot in here. People are putting a lot of time into making some really nice skins for this. So let's go back. I've picked one. Let's apply it. Go back and have a look. Maybe that's your cup of tea, maybe it isn't, but there's a bunch there to choose from. And you've got uh, your standard beautiful home uh, weather app, you know, four by two, four by one. We've seen that, you know, always with what was included on for the phone version. Uh, you've got your super clock. Super clock means it's it's the name they did, uh, the developer gave it. It scales correctly. No matter what your screen layout is, you know, six by seven or four by four, 
it'll scale when you turn it and it looks a lot better so you know those are ones you'd want to look at for any device that you spend a lot of time changing the orientation beautiful today let's that's just a little date and you hit it, it goes into your calendar and beautiful weather one by one and beautiful weather we know save and apply and beautiful weather four by one that's all set up we've already set that up you can only uh, you know use one set of, of skins no matter how many different widgets you have but that's okay because why would you want more than one weather widget or more than one clock widget I don't know but if you do they'll all have the same skin let's uh, move that where we can see it let's put that over here and put that up there and you can see, you know, there's your little one by one weather widget. There's your four by one weather widget. And, you know, they're skinned, they look nice. You tap them and it brings you back to your weather. So if you haven't looked at beautiful widgets yet, you, you know, it's worth time looking at it. This one is a beta. It's designed with that extra bit in there for the tablets. And we'll have a, you know, a link back in the post where you can download it. It doesn't last forever, it's a timed beta but I'm sure they'll get every, all the kinks worked out and it'll be merged into the market version soon. I will talk to you all later. I am out of here.